on the subject matter of accountability. Today we are living in a time where so-called white people refuse to take absolute, total accountability for the behaviors of so-called black people. Now, you have those geniuses out there who will right now argue that, oh no, they're, they're not responsible for the behaviors of so-called black people, the so-called black on black killings, the, uh, the crime sprees, uh, 60% of America's crimes is committed in these areas where so-called black people are, and what black people are doing. And the fact that, you know, they're half the population of the country is so-called black people. And although so-called black people are the minority in this country, as it is written in the message, let me be very clear to you. It is impossible for so-called black people to hate. Impossible. What you or what we have been experiencing this past one century alone is a learned behavior. We're talking about a people who have lived under oppression for 4,759 years. A people who did not read a people who did not know who they were, a people who were forced to integrate with another people, and a people who was forced to build another people's global kingdom. We're talking about a people who did not know what today is perceived as right from wrong. A people who were just children, innocent children, regardless of what their age was on the day of captivity. They were nothing more than children. They didn't hate. There were no guns. There were no knives. There were no spears. There were no hatchets. There were no machetes. None of these lies that institutionalized white supremacy has created around this myth, this so-called black myth. All of that is BS. We're talking about a people that only knew love. They love for one another. They love for this earth. They love for the planet. They love for the animals who were the first to be imprisoned by these savage people. No. So what you have been and what you are experiencing is a learned behavior.